gonna be showing you something I've been working on for like probably six months now. So as I've mentioned before, we have a cruise coming up and basically what this is is a gift bag. I made one for all of the ladies that I'm cruising with. We were married on a cruise about two years ago and I had done this uh, for everybody that sailed with us. So basically I made them all a gift bag. Um, everybody loved it. I mean to this day people still talk about it and stuff like that and I had so much fun doing it that I just wanted to do it with uh, for all of the girls that were sailing with on um, this cruise because it was just so much fun last time. Everybody really appreciated it. Um, I put a bunch of stuff in there that hopefully everybody will find you know useful and um, hopefully they'll like it but I wanted to show you guys this stuff because I got a really good deal on it. Now if you're planning a wedding or if you know somebody that is planning a wedding, uh, a lot of people you know nowadays they do this thing called an OOT bag for people that are traveling in from out of town. So even if you're not going on a cruise, they'll like leave it in the hotel room and this can contain anything from uh, just things from the, you know, that are like close to the city that you're, you know, getting married in or if it's land based. I mean, if you go on Pinterest and just search OOT, uh, you will see so many different things. But this is what I'm doing for the people we're sailing with. No, I'm not getting married, but everybody just loved it so much last time and I had so much fun doing it that I decided to do it again. Okay, so these are the bags that I picked out. Um, this is just like a simple black and white striped tote bag with a little anchor over here in the corner. This is a really nice shoulder bag that you can carry around. It's not too big, it's not too small. Um, just big enough to carry like all the stuff you might need for the beach or if you're going to the pool for the day or just running around the ship, that kind of thing. I was looking for something that size. So I ordered um, these on eBay, and these were less than $5 each. I believe I paid, I don't quote me on this, but I think it was like $4.35 a piece, including shipping. Um, and like I said, I got one for all of the girls that are sailing with us. We're going on a big group cruise. I found these bags, and I, the, I ordered one just kind of as a sample, and I'll link this down below as well. Um, but when I got it in, I knew it was just perfect for what I was looking for. So I went ahead and ordered enough to cover, you know, for everybody. Um, so I got the bag and then separately I ordered this little anchor charm, which I just think is absolutely adorable. It's so sparkly. I don't know if the camera's going to pick it up. The light's really not kind of hitting it the way I need it to right now, but it's just super duper sparkly. It's kind of got those iridescent gems on it. So I just added that um, like anchor wheel to the bag just to make it a little bit prettier. And then now I'm going to show you guys what's inside. And this stuff is from all over the place. I'll tell you where I got everything and I'll try to remember to link everything that I got down below. Some of the stuff is from like the Dollar Tree, so you, I won't be able to link it, but I'll tell you that. Um, but other stuff I will be able to link because I've, I've scoured. I mean, again, it took six months to make these bags, and it's not like a crazy thing, but you know, I wanted to make sure I got the best prices on everything um, and found the cutest stuff that I could for the least amount of money. So I'll go ahead and try to link all that down below because, again, if you you know know somebody that's like either planning to go on a cruise or planning a wedding, something like that, it might be helpful. All right, so the very first thing that I have here in the bag is this tumbler which I picked up from the Dollar Tree. Now, um, for cruises, this is invaluable. The cups on the cruise ships are like this big. Like they give you, <laughs> not, not at the sit down dinners, but at the buffet, at like the Lido deck, it's so tiny. Um, so this is just super awesome. You fill it up with whatever you want, your iced tea, your water, um, and it's much bigger and it's got the lid and the straw and also you can take the straw out if you want and kind of use it that way. Um, it's a really versatile cup. They have a bunch of different kinds of cups right now at the Dollar Tree, really good ones. It was hard for me to choose. And last time for the wedding, we just did like the single, the double wall like lidded tumbler, which is smaller. Um, but these, I actually had some extra room in the bag this time. So I thought these would be a really good fit. Um, anyway, these are, like I said, around the pool during the day, just for the whole week that you're on the, on the ship. This is like a perfect thing to have. Um, just a tip too, if you're going on a cruise, make sure you bring a cup because you're going to want one. I promise you that. Okay. The next thing that's in this bag is this beach towel. Um, this is from Walmart. So I went online to walmart.com and I was able to get each of these towels for approximately $3 and 50 cents. They came in a two pack. Um, so I ordered, you know, enough to cover again, all of the girls on the cruise. But uh, $3.50 is the cheapest beach towel I could possibly, you know, come across. Um, it's a really good size. It's 27 inches by 58 inches long. So really long, nice towel. And the best thing about this thing is it's so compact and lightweight. Um, they, they do have beach towels on the cruise ship and they will, you know, you can take them. They're in your room, so you can take them off the ship, whatever. But if you lose them, not only is it 20 bucks, um, they're also very, very heavy. I mean, they're really nice, luxurious towels. They're super thick. They're super 
plush and it's great for the pool on the ship but when you get off the ship and you have to walk around with that thing all day long um it's really big i mean it's probably i'm going to go ahead and say two and a half size two and a half times as big as this if you roll it this tightly um so i mean yeah it's a large large thing i've seen many 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 a times this is i think my 10th cruise um, but I see many times where people just like abandon them you know on the beach or whatever because they just don't want to carry it back it's just too big you know so anyway I got everybody on a our cruise I got them each you know a beach towel so this is a lot easier to carry um, it's also bright it's differently colored than the carnival beach towels so they'll be able to find their chairs very very easily okay the next thing I got I'm so proud of these finds because I I follow a bunch of like you know um, Target savings like people on Instagram people that like love to get deals at Target and stuff like that and one day this girl posted a deal and Every time they do that, you know, they post these really hot deals, and I'm like, yay, so I run to Target after work or whatever, I never get the deal. Well, guess what? Holla! I finally, finally was able to find one of the deals they posted. They posted that all of these sunscreens and after sun lotions were on clearance, like, and this was back in, like, I want to say January. Um, anyway, they were super cheap because they were, like, clearing out last year's stock to make room for this year's stock. So I got such a tremendous deal on this stuff. I'm so excited. Um, I believe it was like $1.50 to $2 a piece. But anyway, I got this tan extender uh, Australian Gold After Sun Lotion, which is awesome. This stuff, um, I've actually used it before. It works really good and it smells like summer. You know what I mean? It just smells like the sun, the beach. It's got that like coconut, like oh, tropical scent. It's so, so good. Um, so anyway, I was really excited to find that. I've got one of those in there. Then... I also found this sunscreen, which I didn't even know what it was until I got to the store and I smelled it. It's made by, I'll show you the bottle, Soul Sense. Oh my gosh, guys. There was two different uh, scents that they had. Woo! It's the best smelling sunscreen I have ever found. I mean, it is gorgeous. Uh, this one is Flower Blast and they had another one that's in a blue bottle. So I kind of just bought whatever I could find to make sure I had enough for each of the bags. But the blue bottle one, I think actually is my favorite out of all, out of both of them. But this one too, I mean, it is so fragrant. I brought it to my mother-in-law. I was like, smell this. And she was like, what is that? Because it smells so, so good. I was like, it's a sunscreen. So anyway, if you guys can find this Soul Scent sunscreen, I did find it at Target. And again, this, I believe it was under $2. I knew that for each bottle that I got. Um, so anyway, I was able to get a bottle of the sun lotion and the sunscreen for each of the bags. Okay, next, just a random, I've got a pack of tissues in there. Uh, these things, guys, and they're like the Kleenex tissues. It's like one of those things that you don't even think about, but when you're on a cruise ship, like the tissues are so thin, uh, the ones they put in the bathroom. I like to put one of these in the bag because they come in handy. They really, really do. All right, another thing I got are these lanyards. <clears throat> now, you will be able to find these at the Dollar Tree. The one that I wear for work, for my work badge, um, is from the Dollar Tree, but it's super low quality. I hate to say it, guys, but those ones at the Dollar Tree aren't very good. Um, they basically, like the stones all fall off. They're really rigid, so it's like not, I don't know. This one anyway, I'm getting into the Dollar Tree ones. This one is not from the Dollar Tree. This one is from Big Lots. Uh, it was $3, so, you know, quite a bit more, but the stones are so much sparklier. I'm telling you right now, they are like gorgeously sparkling. I hope you guys can see that. Um, $3, but also it's so much better quality. Um, they do sell these on the ship, uh, but I paid the last time I cruised $10 for this exact same lanyard. So uh, when I found these at Big Lots for $3, I was super excited. And I also bought them during like, I think it was like friends and family time when they had 20% off everything in the store or something like that. So I got them for a little bit less than $3, but a really good deal. And what this is, is um, for the, you basically, when you get on the ship, you get a, a card, which is your everything. It's your room key. It's uh, they don't take any cash on the ship except in the casino um, for the machines and stuff. But like for to get a drink at the bar, everything you need to have uh, just that card. There's no cash exchanged whatsoever. Um, so and to get on and off the ship, the same exact thing. So I get these for everyone because uh, to carry your card around, it's like such a convenient way. You can get they actually have a hole punched in the card now, so you just hook it onto there. Um, but I also have these like little clear sleeves uh, left over from the wedding they're in the attic I didn't pull them down for this but um it's just like a little ID holder so I can just hook that on the end of here 
and then um, everybody will be able to carry their cards, their cash, their ID, whatever they want to do um, around on this lanyard, and then they won't have to worry. You know, it's, it's just an easy way to carry it. Even if you just carry it in your hand, it's just, you know, you have everything there at once. I wear mine around my neck because, you know, I don't know. I'm just used to doing it from work and stuff. But uh, anyway, lanyards are super duper helpful on a cruise ship, and hopefully they'll like these as well. All right, so the last thing in my bag is the cutest thing. This is the Oh Shit Kit. <laughs> So I got these little bags off of Etsy and from a seller, and I'll link her down below as well. Um, they were super affordable. I think they were about $1.80 a piece uh, for the bag specifically, and this is the smallest bag that she made. Um, they make She makes bigger bags. I mean, as big as pretty much as you need them to be, whatever you need, she can make it for you. But um, it's a little oh shit kit, and inside I've got all of the things that, you know, when you go, oh shit, you know? <laughs> so I'll show you what I've got. Um, I showed these in a recent Dollar Tree haul. These are the Airborne uh, Plus Energy Packets. Um, you know, just in case you feel a little under the weather, you know, cough, cough, too many margaritas the night before, whatever the case may be, uh, you got, you know, some Airborne there plus your energy to, to get you feeling a little bit better. <laughs> I've got here uh, some Tide Travel Sink Packets. This is so you can wash your uh, bathing suits or underwear or whatever you need to do in the sink. You don't necessarily have to find um, a washing machine, which on a cruise ship, as you can imagine, is a commodity. So I like to bring these anyway because I do like to wash my bathing suits. I like to get the seawater and sand and salt off of them, um, you know, in the sink before I hang them up to dry for the night. So um, that's what I use them for. But I put one of these packets, and this has three packets, so it's three time use in here in each little one of these. Okay, the next thing I got uh, is this little easy mending kit. So basically, what this is, I'll open this one up to show you. Delicate here but it is a tiny little sewing kit. So it's got a needle, um, thread, a couple of buttons, a safety pin, and that's it. Yeah, I think. What's that gray stuff up the top? Okay, I guess that's thread. Anyway, so if you pop a button, you lose a button, you need a safety pin, um, whatever the case may be, you know, you've got it right here. Uh, you can fix your clothes. These um, were so cheap. These were like 18 cents a piece on a website called minimus.biz uh, and you can buy whatever quantity you need. You don't have to buy like a hundred of them or whatever. It just lets you pick whatever quantity. And this is one of the websites I found when I was getting married and making these bags originally for the big group. Um, so I went back to them and ordered them. I'll link them down below too, just so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Um, but you can buy super duper small quantities of like these kind of like travel items and stuff like that. Anyway, got that there. The next thing in here, let me see, is a couple little packets. Um, oh, okay. So two packets of Advil, just in case anybody has a headache. Okay, sorry guys, I'm dropping my stuff over here. Uh, this is uh, Meclizine. So Meclizine is Dramamine, basically. It's, it's a travel motion sickness pill. So I put two packets of those in each of the bags as well, you know, just in case anybody gets any motion sickness, because that is not fun. And also very common on a cruise ship, unfortunately. I um, also have some of these Purell hand sanitizing wipes. I got these on clearance. The whole box of like 100 was like, I don't know, two bucks or something like that. And then also a few of these antacid tablets. Again, anybody has indigestion, it's all covered. A couple of band-aids, and then just some triple antibiotic ointment. Again, band-aids, antibiotic ointment kind of goes hand in hand. You guys know the drill. Blisters, cuts, whatever the case may be. So yeah, that's their little, you know, oh shit kit, just in case anything goes wrong and they forgot anything, they won't have to purchase. Um, you know, the basics, I, I guess, essentially from the cruise gift shop, which will be a lot more expensive than what I paid for it guaranteed. <laughs> All right, guys, so that's the end of my video. Thanks so, so, so much for watching. If you're new to my channel and you have not subscribed yet, please do subscribe. We'd love to have you here. I'm going to be making a whole bunch more cruise travel related videos um, coming up. So keep your eyes peeled for those if you're interested. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.